Hey everybody, it's Melly Playful, and I'm here with Tingu230. What's up? And we're playing Fatal Frame. Well, I'm playing, he's watching, but... Post-mortem photography. Oh, this is creepy. Once again, everybody, warnings for what is in this game. If you have trigger warnings, please um, understand it's a lot about suicide and death and ghost hunting and stuff, so... Um, trigger warnings. Yeah. Here we go. Are we ready? Mm-hmm. Okay. Ren Hojo, a writer, is haunted by a recurring dream in which he kills a young girl during a ritual. He receives an album of postmodern photographs located on his request by Hisoka. Upon viewing one of the photos, Ren recognizes the very scene from his dreams. Eager to delve further into this puzzling mystery, Ren heads to the abandoned inn in person this time, bringing along his assistant, Rui Kagamiya. post mortal photographs. I just remember that from Road to Perdition. Yeah, I remember that. She's beautiful, but she looks sad, too. Yeah. Isn't she the type of woman that you get nervous around? Yeah. There may be more of this stuff out there. Shall I call Hasoka? No, let's go there ourselves. It'll be quicker that way. At this hour? It won't take long. So then, shouldn't you take the camera obscura? You haven't used it yet. This could be your chance. People say there's something off about that place. Okay. Hey, how many of these... Cameras. <laughs> oh, there's always complaining about the leaving things and stuff. How many? Yeah, how many of these uh, cameras are there? Measure upgrade. What was the measure upgrade, Dave? <laughs> I went too fast. There's an unfinished manuscript on the desk. It doesn't have a title yet. I'll need more materials to solidify the theme. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> Memorial portraiture. The act of photographing dead bodies was a practice in Western countries in the 19th century, a time when photography was still a rare and expensive luxury. The bodies of recently deceased family members and loved ones were photographed in lifelike poses as a solemn keepsake of remembrance. While researching the phenomenon, I discovered that a similar custom made its way to Japan as well. Known as postmortem photographs, a small number of these photos still remain. I have been fortunate enough to obtain one such photograph, which I found to contain a certain beauty lacking in its western counterparts. When photography first arrived in Japan, it was accompanied by the prevalent superstition that photographs could steal a person's soul. Whether anyone truly believed this or not, it surely gave postmortem photography a special significance in Japan. If photos were taken with this belief in mind, then postmortem photographs would not simply have been taken as keepsakes or for mourning purposes. Rather, the practice may have carried a certain deeper spiritual significance. It's a reply to the praise of request for the camera obscura. It urges caution in using it. To the camera Renaldo. you... Oh, sorry. Oh. Go ahead. You go ahead. I wasn't sure if I was... <laughs> oh, okay. 
camera you left me to look at it is a device known as a camera obscura. Its purpose is to capture images of supernatural things invisible to the naked eye. These cameras are incredibly rare, with an uh, uh, almost mythical status in the antiques market if you have been known to exist, but this is the first I have ever seen with compound lenses. I don't mean to frighten you, but rumor holds that to own a camera obscura is to invite misfortune. They say everyone who has owned one has either died, lost their mind, or gone missing. The cameras themselves have outlived many owners. While some aficionados do seek them out, the stories of previous owners meeting with such misfortune has had an impact on their value as antiques. My camera obscura was left to a local family after its previous owner passed away. They graciously gave it to me. I believe yours is still usable, but please do exercise caution in doing so. Sincerely, Hisoka Kurosawa. P.S. The cover on your camera obscura is broken, but it seems it originally had a box shape. I doubt you'd sell it to me, but I would like to borrow it for a while if you don't mind. I am happy to compensate. Please think it over. I left the shadow reading report on the sofa. I should take it just in case. On the sofa. It may have some information I could use. This looks like a report written by Yuri. It seems to be about the photo album. Uh, found item report. Client, Ren Hojo, report by Yuri Kuros, Kozukara. Verified by Soko Kurosawa. Details of request. Find items pertaining to post-mortem photography on Mount Kami. Change them if possible. Perform the shadow reading uh, using a post-mortem photograph found on Mount Kami as a token. Located album of post-mortem photographs in Ichiru Manor. Took custody of the object. Okay. Hojo residence. I'm still confused at that map, that overworld map. Right. Not be, be has Ruben turning up? That might be on the shelves. Okay. Right there. <laughs> Came across the book while at the mountain. I don't think it's the story, anything to do with what's going on now, but you never know. Hey, the Maiden Slayer. Mount Kami has long been steeped in legends revolving around suicide and ghosts. Revered as a sacred place since time immemorial, it was once the worshipping ground and home of many mind sh shrine maidens. <laughs> I was about to say some more shrine maidens. <laughs> once there was a man who fell in love with a maiden and came to the mountain in order to court her. However, she remained loyal to her duties and refused his advances. Enraged, the man killed her and threw her into the river. Wow. Okay. Several days later, he returned with a torch and blade and proceeded to brutally butcher all the shrine maidens on the mountain, tossing them into the river as he went. Wow. Jeez. The waters of the mountain flowed red with blood, carrying the slaughtered corpses of the maidens all the way down to the pool of purification. That's where he saw the bodies, right? Right. It is said that the eyes of each of the shrine maidens had been gouged out. Just before killing the first maiden and tossing her to the river, the man's eyes met with those of his victim. Something in her eyes led him to murder the others, or so the legend goes. With all the maidens dead, he killed himself by cutting his own throat. The ghosts of shrine maidens still drenched in those bloodied waters have appeared on the mountain ever since. It is said that those who meet their eyes are led to their deaths. They follow the women into the water and drown themselves. Though only a legend, the story is believed to be based on an actual incident. Local records show that the bodies of several shrine maidens were discovered long ago, and that all rituals and rites ceased to be performed from that day on. That is horrific. Yeah. <sighs> I feel bad reading it, but... Right, but you're still gonna read it. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Hojo can't clean up after himself. <laughs> For someone who's lived alone for so long, he's incapable of housework can't cook and he's bad at tidying up. I'm more like his caretaker than his assistant. He loses things all the time and whenever he doesn't have a book he needs, he blows up. He usually ends up asking Miss Kurosawa for help. One time when I was trying to sort all his books, there was one I couldn't find anywhere. It's like it just disappeared. Miss Kurosawa found it on her shadow reading or found it with her shadow reading. She went into his room on her own then came back out a little while later with the missing book. She just smiled and said something about making the visible visible. What is the shadow reading business anyway? 
That reminds me of that one time. I was tidying up, and I came across something I'd never seen before. It was like Miss Kurosawa said, the invisible became visible. It was kept inside an old box. I don't even know what it was. I put her aside sword out later on, but when I went to take a proper look, it had vanished. It must have gone invisible again. That's crazy. It's almost sunset. Oh, no. We should hurry. Yeah. You should say it's almost sunrise, we should hurry. <laughs> right? I'm gonna go. I, d I just wanna see. Is it. Back to the inn? There's a local superstition warning people not to go up Mount Hakami after dusk. If you climb the mountain in the twilight hours, it'll show you a different form. It's true form. Only those who wish to die. Come here at that time. It's true form. That's just sad. I think that's the inn where the album is found. This must be Ichiru Manor. So, do you think you'll be able to use the camera obscura? I think you should try it out first, just to be sure. Okay. Ren's camera obscura. You have a different tutorial. Man. Unless you take multiple photos at once. Use the multi shot function to take four photos at once, dealing more damage. Taking multiple photos at once also helps to get fatal frame shots. After multi shot, the camera's gear will take longer than usual to reload the film. Keep in mind that multiple shots quickly use up a lot of film. Damn! <laughs> What did it say about standard shots? Oh, okay. Hey! So that's what it does. Okay. Feel free to take more photos, but then all your ammo is like going down. Is the camera working? Well, you look like you, so yeah. Is that a good thing? Uh, uh already getting creeped out. Seems like we need to get more ammo. I hear Seems the like older part of this end, the part that's further back inside, it was part of some temple or shrine. Okay, so After that's where you're going? In, the proprietor's family lived here, but it doesn't look like anyone was a massive landslide that hit Mount Hakami. Maybe they were all buried under the rubble. I kind of wanted to look hey, around. Looks like the album you asked for was found in the old building. I know, just stop talking to yeah, me. You're getting me all mixed up. Like it's pretty much the same way you went last time, just you went up the mountain instead of to the left. An O3 story inn stands in silence and landscape, raced down the mountain and through the inn, dumping it all. It dumping all it picked up in the pond. Sorry. Back here again. Multi shot. I thought it would just like use up one film for a multi shot. Here's the trailer again. I wonder if the same power Hosaka uses for the shadow reading. Probably. <sighs> Is there like a closed door? There are some doors we didn't actually go into, right? I'm just gonna shit on you. <laughs> ah! Should have kept it pulled up. It's all good. And I'm gonna go over here first and see. A leap of scrap wood at the end of the hallway. The water must have washed it down here. There's a hole in the wall. I can see the next room over. It just looks like it's flooded. Okay. Looks just as flooded, huh? Yo, 
go over there, the sun was uh, setting, right? Yeah. Initially with uh, the Yuri. Oh. <laughs> I was wondering if that was going to close. The hatch of the duct yeah. has shut itself. It must have been the wind. That was not the freaking wind. Oh yeah, it's the wind. Woman. Well, I mean, there's... Oh man, okay. And then woman again. <laughs> they should just say group in the shadows. Right. <laughs> just use it once. People in the shadows. Come on. I guess the initial slot should just like weaken it and then like use the powerful ones to just. Right. Just fully destroy them. Hands. That's fun. <laughs> They're just waiting. Wave your hands if you can. Or third. What is it? Uh, raise your hands if you can. They're waving like you just don't care. Wave your hands <laughs> in the air. Yeah, in the air, that's what it was. <laughs> it should be around here. Is that it? There's definitely gonna be a hand. <laughs> this time. No? Okay. Nope. Wow, I'm surprised. Oh, the person left. Oh, you're real. I mean you're I thought it was just a picture for this person. Is there an indicator thing like how much health they have left? Not that I see. Right? Yeah, I was just I'm just wondering because it's like Back it up! Back it up! Get out of here. Man, you push her all the way up to the stairs. Yeah, I was trying to get her off my assistant. Yeah. Okay. Oh, can you touch them? No. Oh, okay. Was that just a Yuri power? I think so. I don't know. I just started playing him, so I don't know. They like lingered there for a long time. Yeah, but they don't do the. Uh, they just linger and then you touch them. It'd still be there. You know? Step up here, and the part of the floorboards, I think, was a display to Aqua. Aqua. Whatever. Aqua. <laughs> Aqua. suit reminds me of, uh, Sebastian Castellanos. Yeah. <laughs> this must be the room where Hisoka found that album. Yeah, it seems so. There you go. 
Oh. It's a letter. Oops. Yeah. We gotta get closer. Ah. Close. <laughs> Is it there still? Huh. Okay, at this point, I just feel like I'm wasting ammo. <laughs> yeah. You think I need to use the four thing on it? I don't know. What was that even for? Cause then, when you were when you use it as uh, the other character, you just took a picture once, right? Yeah, but it's not working, so. Yeah. Well, let's see if there. I mean, <laughs> let's see if there's anything else you can do besides leave. Is there anything else around the room? This is not working. Oh, well, I'm gonna have to read up, I guess. <laughs> I wonder what. There, there must have been something we're missing from what happened last time. Ah, uh, it popped up as I was in the process of. Yeah. Oh, you had a lock on or something. Well, I was locked on earlier. I'm trying to get it perfect in the. It says you gotta turn, you gotta turn it until the the white box turns red. Yeah, see, we forgot about that already. Oh, you have to lock on though. You have to lock on and then turn it. Yeah. Ah. Uh. B, you just forgot a step. Crambledo note has materialized. This must be a camera was reacting to. There's note lying on the shelf. Okay, you ready to read? Uh, yeah. How long has it been since I lost everything? The mouse followed up half my inn. All I have left is an old album of postmodern photographs, one left by my father. I don't even know who these photos are of, but it's the last vestige of family I have. How long have I spent here? wallowing in the darkness. It doesn't matter. I'll burn it all. And then there will only be me. I think I'll end up in the observation room on the roof. The sunset is lovely up there. Huh. The camera is reacting to the note. 
using the note as a token, I might find a trace that will lead me to some information about that photograph. Ah! Attacking. Why they gotta be attacking in a ramp room? Get out of here. stairs at hmm. not here yep. right there what's our enemies are This one's going fast. That one was stepping. Backing up, it's you're good. <laughs> what behind you? Oh man, hey right, Rui, just stand there. Stagger. Yeah. Oh gosh. Right there. <laughs> Self a lot of hair. I think that uh, I backed this all the way at you. Yeah, yeah I did. did. I backed us all the way to his back. <laughs> Alright, up the stairs we go. Oops, I hit the wrong button. According to the stories, after the landslide, we went in and moved to the third floor. Order of him to the third floor. He said he burned himself to death there, or that he threw himself into the lake. Come on, enough story. Tell me about it. they say that if you look up at the third floor veranda, you'll see someone looking back down. Really? Oh, lovely. I'm sorry. 
quiet. <laughs> Man, he he talks a lot. It's hard to get angry, yeah. Some of the arrows gets you confused about like where you're going and stuff. Oh yeah, yeah. It's like when it's down below, you think it's behind you, but they mean it's like below you. <laughs> right. It, it is kind of confusing. Door not visible. <laughs> oh, it's in the little thing down there. Okay. Let's go back downstairs. Maybe I should have the key to this door. It's like, where is that item? <gasps> like the one found in the old building. Here you go. Even before the landslide, there were always strange goings on around here. Some years ago, two girls went missing on a college field trip. The police were stumped. A few days later, one of the girls turned up again, seemingly out of her mind. There were lots of theories, but most people believe they were simply spirited away. That girl came back each year to look for her friend, like some sort of pilgrimage. Countless people have gone missing here over the years. We're all used to it by now. My father was spirited away too, as was the folklorist. Keiji Watari. Or Watari. Next, it'll be my turn, I bet. I'll vanish for the rest of them. I doubt anyone will think to come looking for me. That is a sad thought to think that no one's gonna come look for you. Yeah. This game is actually just really sad. You yeah. Know? No, what are you. Okay, I figured out how to turn around fast. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, go downstairs. By that hatch. Sure. I can't get the hatch to duct open. Hatch to the duct open. It's being shut for a powerful force. I know the yeah. camera's res Taking photos different. identical to the psychic photographs taken with the camera's gear can break seals, blocking your access. Take a photo that matches the one you already have. Okay. Match the photo. Okay. Does it show where the where your photo is? <laughs> Let's 
because I think it was off to the left. Like, oh, down the hall. Sorry, I'm, I'm trying to get out of the camera so I can... Oh, where does it show the photograph? tokens or something. Oh, there it is, a creeping shadow. Okay, to the left. How does it know, though? You think... It, it, oh, okay. It already locks on when you're at that angle like that. It should have the photo show up on the screen while you're taking it, so... It should. Know. That would be smart. Yeah. But they'd want it to be harder, I guess. <laughs> Among the pipes. So let's go stick our hand in. Stick our hand in there. You know there's gonna be a hand in that one. Yep. Oh, no. Not the same. Wow. More ghosts. Yep. Ah, see, I couldn't touch it. I didn't get there fast. Fast enough. It's all good. They disappear fast, you know? Yeah. <laughs> they always want to make you go through, like... Maze to get through. We gotta go. Oh, okay. Jeez, there's like glass on his back. Ah, I missed him. Oh, it did not take fast enough. It is knees. <laughs> How do you get up? <laughs> because you're on the ground right now. Shoot. Hello, 
ghost left something behind when it disappeared. A solid okay. note has been left there. It looks like it was left by the innkeeper. This place has gone for a tourist hotspot to a suicide hotspot, but I suppose that has always the case. The mountain and death go together side by side. Mikamori was once known as the Grove of Shine Maidens, a sacred grove where the mountain's maidens oversaw the deaths of pilgrims, easing their passing to the other side. I like that. I envy it. I wish someone would be there for, to see, see me off. Was that the man who wrote this note? Maybe I'll find something upstairs. Wow. Ruhi, are you alright? I need sure. to Okay, opening the door with the yellow key that I found downstairs. Stairs. Okay, I get you, but I'm gonna go right over here and see if there's something right here. There it is. There you go. Item time. What is that? Oh, come on. I hate that that hurts <laughs> us too, because I just yeah. used medicine. A mirror, oh, stone. mirror stone. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. Uh, bring me back to life. So, yeah, you got a free one. The door is being blocked by something inside. Or outside, There's whatever. To touch him. Got him. The sun is set, beckons. It's calling me to the water. This is the right thing to do. <sighs> so it's kind of like reliving that moment. I'm gonna go look around really fast. Sorry. Yeah, because you were down below. You shattered. Shattered into the glass. What? That was taken. didn't ask to turn around. <clears throat> this would have been a beautiful hotel. Yep. Charred. The man might have left something behind. If he did, likely it'd be it hidden. Like there was a fire. This must be where the innkeeper moved. Okay, I have to use the camera probably. Yeah. Heard that sound too, right? Not like a dousing rod or whatever. Yeah. Cutscene. You going? Me and Beckon.
Dude, get him! Really? Oh wrong? gosh, you got stuck on the thing. <laughs> so awkward. Is it, is there? Oh, it's like pushing him off. I'm gonna have to fight her. Instead of saving Ruri really fast. Yeah. Like, she might be the one that... That leads... These people into, like, falling or something. Ooh. Weird. The mail, he wasted. Core shot, full body shot. Alright, now turn to the left. Okay, good. Full to the right. Ooh. Ka 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 <laughs> I can put the sound effects for like Killer Instinct on here. <laughs> you hear she's hanging from a noose. Yeah. And she swings. It's very creepy. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Ah, that was a lot right there. Multiple shot, yeah. Do -do 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 -do. Come on, man. Keep coming. She needs to swing herself. Remember anything? Let's go home. You cannot leave the mountains. Huh? Well, oh, this is okay. great. I thought it was like next chapter. I guess we're not that. Because everybody has to fight her. Come on, ladies. Yourself down, I was like, what the heck? You can take a picture. Oh, 
backed up. I'm trying to keep her off of him. You yeah. know? Yeah. Come on, she's got weak. Why don't we just stand behind Red? Kid, you've got to get out of this way. <laughs> It was a little okay. delayed reaction. She's like, oh, wait, he hit me five minutes ago. Look at damage over time thing. <laughs> We're leaving. Captain Price. A woman dressed like a shrine maiden. Is she connected to the note that I found? There's a note here. It seems to have been singed a little by the fire. And it's probably wet, too. Okay, you can read. Probably. The album Postmortem Photographs was assembled by a folklorist who lived on the mountain. His name was Keiji Watarai. He became fascinated by the custom and moved to Mount Akama to study how it spread through Japan. My father seemed to take an interest in these photos as well. Strange foreign customs always fascinated him. While he was running the inn, he helped Watarai collect postmortem photographs from the nearby town. On Mount Akama, water itself was to deified. It seems like Watarai wanted to get a deeper understanding of this unique outlook, so he set up a house in the forest to experience it firsthand. Okay. He was greatly aided by my father, who had already set up the inn by that point. He remodeled it from an old, unused shrine. I think he thought the extra religious heft would help attract more visitors. One day the folklorist went missing. Several people formed a search party, but they were unable to find a trace. Even the road to his house seemed to have been lost to the woods. My father scoured the mountain too, but all he found was that photo album. He was soaking wet when he got back. I remember he was acting strangely. His eyes had this curious glint, almost like he'd been possessed by something. The next thing I knew, my father went missing as well. I forgot about the photos until I found them in an old building after a landslide. Now I understand why my father left. That's right, too. These photos are so beautiful. Hmm. A folklorist who lived on Mount Hikami, is that how you say it? Probably Hikami? has some old books about him. We should get back. Ryu needs to rest. The photo album left behind by the innkeeper was put together by folklorists who lived on Mount Hikami. What? What anyway? As Rin and Ryu <laughs> explored the inn and traced the spirit of its owner, a ghost tried to lure Ryu, Ryu to suicide. Then, through the pouring rain, an ominous shrine maiden appeared. Rin and Ryu left the mountain with more questions than they were answered than when they started. We got an A. Even though I got hit a few times. Thank you all so much for watching. We really hope you enjoyed it. Yeah. Bye. As much as Mel enjoyed playing it. <laughs> I like it. It's, I'm enjoying yeah. it. So, yeah. And I'm not getting scared, so that's good. So. Okay. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Later.